Okay, Merry Christmas. We've got a new coffee grinder. This is a handheld coffee grinder. Right here. And we got different coffees. And I'm gonna grind some up, put it in a French press here, and we'll see what it does. We're gonna try this. Great coffee is not the result of chance, is what it says on the outside. It's made by Intelligentsia. It's the whole bean. Black Cat Classic Espresso. Ooh, espresso. Mm. Well, we're not, we're not gonna do espresso. We're gonna, just gonna grind it up here. And uh, it says two tablespoons of coffee for every seven fluid ounces of water. And so this says, uh, I think this is 20, 20 ounces. So we need at least three, three deals of, of three tablespoons of it. So we'll just start grinding up something here and um, let's see how it turns out. So let's pop this baby open. It smells really good. Oh yeah, look at that. Woo! It smells good, I like it. Okay, so it says to rotate it uh, counter clockwise, clockwise, or wait a minute. I think clockwise, I better get the instructions. Hold up. <clears throat> okay, I'm back. It says, uh, blah, 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 turn, uh, manual, adjusting, hold the grinder, da 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 da, clockwise. Let's spin the handle clockwise. Clockwise, to, okay, so clockwise, all right. Okay, and it says not to overfill it, so we'll just put a few deals of it in here. And the main reason I got this is I wanted to try mixing up my own blend. So I was gonna maybe add a little vanilla to it or maybe some chocolate or cinnamon kind of powdery stuff to it, just to see, you know, mix it up. Because right now I've got this Starbucks peppermint mocha I got uh, a French vanilla in here from Folgers, but <clears throat> there's what I got right now. So let's go grind it up here. Let's put it up here so you can see. All right, it's working. It's getting there. Right. It's getting there, it's filling up. It's got about halfway to go, so let's make it fine right now, I think. So that'll work. <clears throat> we can adjust it too by moving the little uh, serrated disc that's in there. But for now, I'm just gonna get this going here. All right. <laughs> okay, so we got we got one batch done here, and I. I made it a little bit coarser because I want it, I want it just a bit coarser, not espresso style. And I'm gonna do another another little bit here. I'm just gonna add some more. And that smells really good. Trying it again. And it's got the bigger bigger chunks. We got our, our third batch in there, so it's getting there, and we're finding it's easier to put it kind of between your, your knees here and grind it here. And you get a faster spin or turn on the handle, more leverage, and then at that point it'll you'll you'll hear it. See, you can hear it still grinding away. But you know you have it is you'll hear the, the grinding quit. So it's starting to get close, right there. There, grinding quit, so we know it's ready. And there it is. All right, so I did a fine blend and a coarser blend, and right there. So maybe later on I'll get a little fancy and add some, some you know, French vanilla stuff or, or vanilla uh, extract or something to make it get that little taste in there. But all right, let's go uh, mix it up with that French press. And uh, so we transfer everything to the or we, we put the grinder to the the other uh, jar that it comes with. And the one they use for grinding has this little plastic bottom here 
I guess it's so you get better better leverage one year it doesn't slip so we'll just move it to this other one here and we're to grind away with the next one whenever we're ready for that let's see there we go yeah we're ready to grind away with this one next time we need to get some more but for now we got enough all right let's go and uh do that french press okay so we've got it in the press now and we're just gonna let it seep for four minutes, then we'll push it down, and then we'll try it out here in a moment. Okay, time is up. Let's go and press it. And we did that medium, or fine, as well as a medium ground. All right, let's taste it. Woo, smells good. Woo, very tasty. Let's see, here it is. The Black Cat Classic Espresso Intelligentsia. It's a good cup of coffee.